Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough, redo, forest frenzy, that's the name you're looking for, and I think this is the level that I was thinking of that had the really obscure secrets, I think, keyword think, I could be wrong, but we'll see, we'll see, uh, I hope I didn't need that, <laughs> uh, that's a uh, scary K to get. But I will try it. <laughs> yeah, just roll off the edge with the cartwheel and then do your best. And I will try and get this both ways. Yeah, I'm feeling skillful today. <laughs> Not that skillful though. Um, oh, I don't, oh, oh, shoot. Uh, do I need that? Maybe I need that. Well, we'll no, I guess there's a, there's a rope here. And let her. Oh, that's kind of risky too. Ooh, I like their jumping pattern. They like like do a couple hops and then they do their jump. You can feel out their jumps pretty easily if you get their pattern, but yeah. And when it comes to these sorts of sections right here, the key is not to move unless you need to. <laughs> so just kind of just kind of nudge your way through it just a little at a time. And there we go. Ooh. By the way, I, I keep forgetting to mention, unlike uh, um, Donkey Kong Country 2 and 3, there are no tag team throws, so you can't like throw one Kong to get up to a different area like a higher area that you couldn't normally jump to, like there is in this game, or any super special moves like that. Well, I mean, I guess Donkey Kong has the ground slam thing, but I mean, you know, like, it, that's really useful. <laughs> uh, I believe that both of the secrets are right at the end, you know, the bonus areas are right at the end. I think there's two bonus areas, I could, I could be wrong about that, but I, yeah. Uh, I'll grab that G. Oh, I missed the G after all the work I was doing. Well, I got that one up very carefully. Uh, oh shoot, this one I need to be really low on because, yeah, there's a barrel cannon right there. I don't know if you could see that depending on how the screen's cut off in the video editing. Because I kind of need to square it up to 4 to 3 aspect ratio. Uh, this one? Yeah! Ho ho ho! You can fool my eyeballs. No, my eyeballs. They see everything. <laughs> and oh shoot, I ooh uh, uh, I need that for something, I think. But if I leave it, it'll despawn, so I gotta take it with me now. Alright. I gotta try and get underneath the critters. Oh! Critters of Doom! Two barrels. Alright, does it here? No. Was it here? No, it's probably the last one, just because. Yep, there it is. That's the other obscure secret. And let's see if we can get all the bananas here really quick. Yeah, two at a time. Ooh, I'm not holding the Y button or anything like that. I just want my climbs to be really controlled. And there, oh shoot, well, oh, oh. Well, I'll get them on the way back anyway. And an on guard token to finish it off. Oh yeah. And where this hole was, it just pops me right on top of him. Yep, there's the exit. So it was the absolute last one there. Screen transition. Temple Tempest. Begin! Uh, I don't think there's a secret up there offhand, but I'll, I'll try and look. Oh, oh, okay, there's a secret up there. There's a Rambi token. I was wrong! I'm glad I checked up there. Ooh, letter K, letter K! <laughs> and that rope only goes one way, too. Uh, oh, no, shoot! I just realized I needed that barrel. You'll see why. <laughs> Alright, I'm down to 69 lives now. Oh, 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 I'm gonna increase that. <laughs> Let's see what we can get in the Rambi one. And this time I'm not gonna burn too much time that I am not able to get that times two one. I'm getting some kinda awkward lag here, but we'll see what I can pull off regarding with the lag. I'll just kinda do one quick lap that way, and I'll do one quick lap this way. And then I'll try and go all the way across the top of that times two thing that I wasn't really able to show you before. So we go on the igloo, we jump up on here, and this is pretty awkward because it's a slippery, because ice. Yeah, because why not have ice? Oh, shoot, shoot, I ran out of time! <laughs> man, man, I'll never be able to show that times two one on Ramby stage at this rate. Alas, 
Alas, by the way, you'll notice when you roll into enemies, you get actually get an increase in speed. So be careful with that. It could be kind of kind of haphazard, and this is what you need the barrel for. <laughs> I very distinctly remember that. All right, going, going, going across for espresso. Oh yeah. And I, I wait. Wasn't there supposed to be a one up in that bonus? area I thought well whatever if you hit if you don't have espresso there you're gonna have to use the vines to swing on a la level two but uh yeah it's not that big of a deal you're doing it either way and yeah you notice that we're being oh I missed the letter oh <laughs> you notice that we're being um chased by stuff and by the way did you notice that oh smaller enemies go right underneath the the legs of espresso yep that is the whole kind of trick I should say the whole additional thing but she can't jump on things normally so you got to be pretty careful with her and yeah we're being chased so you got to keep moving got to keep grooving and secret bonus area <laughs> uh, oh no I lost my no I lost my chicken why why? Why? Well, at least I won't be attacked by. Well, never mind. <laughs> oh, this one's this one's a feisty one. Yee. Okay, I know it's not a chicken; it's an ostrich. But still, still, whenever I think of chicken, I think of the many traumatizing attacks I've had based on a oh, certain fluffy bird. Ooh, <laughs> it's just ooh, I did it! <laughs> oh, no one up for that, really? Well. A Rambly token it is then. <laughs> if you can get two Rambly tokens a stage, you could in theory keep grinding for lives on this sucker all day long. Um, oh, I didn't lose my bird after all. I would like to... Yeah, there we go. Oh, no! It despawned! <laughs> oh, oh. I, I can't get the banana. She's, she's too tall. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay, I don't really feel like getting off right now. And, and away we go with another chase! Expresso really makes this pretty trivial, really, in all honesty. And yeah, you can't jump on anything. It's, she's not winky, so... Cannot deal with those sorts of... Oh, well, you know what? That's fine. <laughs> I gotta move it and groove it. And I'm gonna lose her by the end of the level anyway. <sighs> Alright, now for one of... Well, after this, candy save point here. For next one is one of the uh, longest and uh, obscure secrets and stuff. Yes, this, she's got secrets that I'd like to uncover. Ne never mind, never mind. Let's just see our percentage so far. We've got forty percent. We're making some pretty good progress here. And next level, orangutan gang. Like it's not orang a tang gang, it's orangutan gang. I'm not sure what the pun is in that name. All I know is there's five bonus areas in this sucker and uh, there's a bunch of them that are pretty obscure. So start out, this isn't like something that you need for a bonus area or anything like that. Oops, it's just this is, this is just something fun. Let's clear out the area. Woo! Yeah, and you actually should clear out all the enemies from like here until the next spot that you find ex espresso. You'll see what I mean when I get to that spot because, well, yeah, it's you definitely don't want the enemies to be there. Let's just put it that way. I don't want to spoil it, but let's just say that we missed the bonus area already and we need espresso to get to it. How does that sound to you? Huh? 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 Well, now watch this. Remember I was saying that she's a lot taller than the smaller enemies? Yep, yep, yep. That's how it works. <laughs> you can also get that letter O there uh, if you use a rolling thing, but you know, I, I really don't want to risk it. I'm just going to go back this way with her and because this, this is why we cleared out the enemies. And how do I get past you without losing my bird? Okay, that works. And now back over here, you want to this. You got to do a pretty good jump here, and go for it. Yeah, who is gonna think of that one? Seriously, that is ridiculous. All right, let's spell Winky. This could be taken many different ways, but I think they're referring to the frog. There we go! <laughs> if you touch other letters, you'll fail, by the way. 
And of course, you get a winky token for your troubles. Oh, hello there. Hello there. Let's spell Rambi. Oh, I, th I didn't remember there being more than one here. But we did it. We got it. Is there another one? Oh, there is. Oh, I forgot what this one is. E. N. G. U. Oh, on guard. Okay. <laughs> I should have known. It's just that they're spinning and I can't do anagrams when they're spinning and I get all confused. There we go. Probably one more for the last critter. Oh, yeah. Espresso. All right. Can I do it? Can I do it for the ultimate and bonus prizes? Probably. Absolutely. Woo oh, yeah! Okay, maybe that wasn't the ultimate and bonus prizes. There's just one token, you know, one big token for each of them. But whatever, whatever. Okay, now over here, this is interesting. You get pooped out up here. We missed a whole lot of the level. Let's just put it that way. And, uh, oops, well, I don't need that barrel anyway. But yeah, I'll show you the rest of the level later. But this is where things get really nasty. Uh, it's best if you have Expresso for this, but it's possible to do it without her. Uh, oh, this isn't the spot that I was thinking of that you need her for. I, I should say it that makes it easier to get stuff with her for. But yeah, uh, you got to kind of ditch her anyway, because there's a barrel here, and there's a... Uh, where is it? Okay, it's there. <laughs> I just didn't want to lose my barrel. And yeah, there's a bonus area here. Bounce up high, get that letter G. See, we missed quite a lot of level there. We missed where the letter N was and all sorts of stuff. So I'm going to take a second run through this level soon enough. But that's one bonus area. Now grab... Whoa! Grab this barrel again. Go down here, up another one of these, and open up that one. It's just never-ending fun with these bonus areas, huh? <laughs> I swear, it just decide to make them as obscure as you possibly can make them. It, and it's the solution, if you don't have a guide for this, is just jump down every pit. That is the solution. And this is Mankey Kong, a rebellion to the Kong family. Now, you'd think that you'd be able to, you know, jump right down there to, whoops, jump right down there to get to that bonus area, right? Oh, oh, I guess you can, but I thought that would kill you if you did that. Well, maybe I'm thinking of the one in the middle of the stage, oh, or something like that. Because, yeah, there's another bonus area in the middle of the stage when I show you the rest of the stage. It's just that I have to get that first one out of the way, no matter what, first, because that is just a total pain to get. And there's a secret area right near the exit there as well, uh, but I kind of used the barrel, I realized, before I got to that point. But that's okay, because as I said, I'm replaying the stage anyway. So uh, let's do some monkey business here. And I really like the sunset theme of the, the whole stage, too. I think that's it's pretty beautiful. And, uh, okay, yeah, I'm out of here. <laughs> I mean, get out of here, Barrel. All right, so now that I'm not going to go to the, whoop, to the first bonus area, you'll be able to see everything that's past Espresso, which is, well, a whole lot of stuff, as I said, that you missed. But, oh, no, 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 we'll be able to see them soon enough. But first, let's kill these clap traps and see if we can get all the letters of the alphabets. Okay, just two, two more letters that we didn't get before. <laughs> careful now. Just got to kind of do a really careful rolling jump there, and you can get the... Oh, the bananas I actually got to do another one for. You know what? That's not worth it. <laughs> I'll just take a, a spare hit here in the form of espresso. And uh, hopefully rock the rest of the stage here. And there's a checkpoint. Don't have to worry about that whatsoever. And there's my buddy. Uh, I don't remember if there was something... No, it wasn't here. It was down by another DK barrel, I think. Where the other secret bonus thing was, if I recall correctly. By the way, you cannot jump on those barrels, no matter if you're riding on... Uh, I mean, uh, riding on a Sprixpresso or if you're jumping on them normally. That, that That's a total no-go. Okay, this is a spot that's best done with espresso, as I was saying before. Get underneath everything and go across. There we go. And we gotta ditch our bird. Oh no! I just... Mm, that was... I threw it the wrong way. The secret is over there and... Ah, ah, is it possible to maybe like take another barrel that way? Probably not. Because yeah, this is the one that I, I, I thought 
was that you drop, oops, that you drop down, I mean that you, excuse me, you can't drop down to, because here I'll, I'll show you. If you decide to go down to where that cliff was from up over here, uh, it'll just outright kill you. <laughs> uh, oh! Oh, I couldn't fit down there because it's, I guess because I'm Donkey Kong. But yeah, if you try and drop down there, it'll it'll kill you. But I got the checkpoint anyway, so it's not that big of a deal. And I, I guess it's nice to be able to show you doing it the other way with Diddy Kong. You're not going to be able to pull this off with Donkey Kong, though. So try and save your Diddy until you get to that point. And, oh no you don't. Oh yeah, you can block them with kegs, that's that's a thing you can do. But that's not really practical, because there's no, there's not a lot of kegs around these parts. Alright, let's clear it out, and clear it out, switch to Diddy. Now, you really, really want to stretch out your jumps here. So, really jump far, because yeah, look how close that comes. To being able to miss it, but it is, I assure you, is completely possible to do with Diddy Kong, and I will show you. I gotta, gotta save my monkey, <laughs> just in case, just in case. All I need is to get it once with Diddy Kong, just to show it's possible. <laughs> I know it's possible, I've done it before, and I can do it again. Hmm. But can I do it on camera? Maybe, maybe. All right, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, can I do it from- no, I can't- I can't do it from a place higher up, can I? Because they're all connected by vines, right? Right? Yeah, I thought so. Oh, shoot! Well, that, that's okay, I guess. I don't really need that, but... Alright. Mm! Oh! <laughs> Did you see that? I actually landed on the edge, but slipped off. Such a disappointment. Alright, attempt number three! Well, technically, it's, this is attempt number four, because... I had a, you know, I got there with Espresso with ease, and, well, I kind of flubbed it completely, because I, I threw the barrel in the wrong direction. Uh, yeah, the simplest of mistakes can lead to such time-consuming consequences. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Let's stretch out those jumps. <laughs> okay. And there's another big one like that here. Ready, ready, ready? Okay. Don't. 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 Good boy. <laughs> now then I just gotta make it to the end of the stage for the last secret that I flubbed up on as well. DK Barrel was right there if you didn't notice that. Alright. Okay. <laughs> uh, I think I want to leave that DK Barrel until after I clear this out because I think I'm near the end of the stage. So I'm just gonna kind of do a safety check here on all the stuff. Whoa! <laughs> By the way, this is a reference to the uh, Donkey Kong arcade game, if you didn't realize that. Um, but yeah. Oh, this isn't even close to the end. I was wrong about that. Oh shoot, I grabbed the barrel. That's not good. I Because I can't drop barrels in this, ah, in this game. And yeah, I, I kind of need that for that over there. But maybe... Maybe I'll be able to grab that DK barrel that I saved all the way back on the other side and You know take it all the way over there and hopefully no enemies will respawn and Cause me great ire like say a hidden barrel popping out of nowhere popping my barrel Maybe maybe hopefully not <laughs> Let's just do our best to keep our barrels here. That's why I left it just in case of disaster. There we go. Ugh. Alright, Espresso, you're here for this bonus area, and just for this bonus area, to cross this gap for that one up, and maybe, maybe I can get the rest of the bananas. Maybe, I don't think I'll be able to pull it off. No, I missed one banana. <laughs> That's okay, though, and you can just get popped out right along that side. Any secrets up here? No, no, okay. <sighs> It is done. <laughs> and with that, I'm gonna end off the part here, because that level is a level that is exhausting. So I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when I go check out Cranky's Cabin, the next level, the boss up on that island over there, maybe starting the next world, who knows? Who knows? It all depends how fast I go. 